years ago, back in the early 2000s, I would get together with my friends and we would have a vegan Thanksgiving. We would each bring our own vegan dish and I used to bring a broccoli, spinach, and cheddar roll made on croissant roll dough, which I made in the last video. So we're gonna take that recipe that I made last video and we're gonna use it in this video and we're gonna make a delicious broccoli, spinach, cheddar roll. Cooking with the vegan zombie. Okay, what you're gonna need is some kind of steamer. I have a bamboo steamer right here. I have um, about a medium head of broccoli and one package or eight ounce of fresh spinach, which will wilt down to about nothing. We're just gonna chop our broccoli. Remember that, chopping broccoli? Chopping broccoli, about like that. All right, and we're gonna transfer the broccoli to a bowl. In this bowl, we have about a teaspoon of olive oil about half a teaspoon of sea salt, half a teaspoon of paprika, some cracked pepper, however much you want, and about a teaspoon of the Worcester sauce, Worcester sauce, I like to say that, about half of a teaspoon of dried basil. And that's all you really need. Now you're just gonna mix that up, mix that together. It doesn't really matter too much, but I'm gonna put these on the bottom. And on the top one, we're gonna put all the spinach. We're gonna make sure that all fits right in there. Remember, this is gonna wilt down to pretty much nothing, so close that up. Get in there, you guys. We're gonna bring this over to the stove and we're gonna steam it for about five or 10 minutes. All right, so we have our dough from the last recipe. We're gonna do the same thing we did. We're gonna roll this out into a circle, or at least as good a circle as you can get. That's pretty good. Now we're gonna cut it, triangles. Then you're gonna get a, a tray like this, a pizza tray. You're gonna kind of, uh, just kind of do what I'm doing here. Basically, we're gonna make another circle with the triangles facing outward, kind of like a sun. Overlapping them just like that. And that's gonna be your base down here. A little circle in the middle. So that's, that's what we're looking at right here. And here's our spinach. And then I have two cloves of crushed garlic. Throw that in there. Mix them around. And I like to put it on the skillet for a little bit just to ensure that the garlic is nice and cooked. So over here, I'm just heating that up. And the broccoli is done. So what we're gonna do now is gently put this on here. On there, just like this. Right how I'm doing it, right on the inside. And we need cheese, we need some cheddar cheese. I have Good Planet cheddar cheese shreds. Good Planet is one of my favorite cheeses. They're from Greece. Everything they make is really good. I had the chance to try them at one of the expos I went to, and I have my hands on a package here. I haven't seen them in stores where I live, but I will put their information below if you want to check them out. I'll tell you what, we have come a long way since I first went vegan till now as far as uh, vegan cheese goes. So we're gonna take a little bit of that and put it on top of that broccoli so it melts, just like that. Okay, so very carefully take some of that spinach. And we're gonna put that on top of the broccoli. This is so easy to make. Everyone at the party seems to love it. Even if it's a party with just you, you're gonna love it. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a little bit more cheddar on there because cheddar makes it better as long as it's vegan, cruelty free. I have my oven preheated to 350 degrees. No, I don't, but I don't wanna do that right now. So you're gonna fold that over, hold it down to the bottom. Fold this one over and push it down to the previous one, as you see how I, how I did that. And then this is how this is gonna be closed up. They're all gonna fold over on each other. Look at that cheese. Mmm, that's good cheese. I don't remember where I learned how to make this, but I've been making this for about 20 years now. You can take the rest of this broccoli, mix it in with the spinach, and just eat it. And the other thing I have, just like I did in the last video, I have a little bit of melted Miyoko's butter. You can use whatever butter you want, as long as it's vegan. And we're just gonna brush that on top. I just like to put a little bit of uh, cheddar on the top as well. Not too much, just a little bit. And there you have it. That's gonna go in the oven for about 15 to 18 minutes until it's nice and golden brown. All right, in the oven it goes. All right, it's actually been in there for about 25 minutes. We're gonna take it out right now. There we go. If you want, you can also brush more of that Miyoko's butter. 
that extra flavor and shine. So there it is. This is our broccoli cheddar roll and it is a crowd pleaser. All right, we're gonna taste test this. You go ahead and cut them and that's what they look like in the inside. Check that out. Can you see how good that smells? That is delicious. That is really good. The dough came out perfect. The broccoli and the cheddar. Well, that's another really easy recipe for our holiday series. Uh, you could really make this any potluck or anything like that. If you guys like this video, give me the thumbs up. Let me know if you guys try this out and if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell so you don't miss notifications when my new videos come out. Other than that, just uh, watch out for zombies and I'll see you guys in the next video.